Okay, and welcome back. Uh, now I'm going to show you guys how to make the grill top. As you see, before we used it, it had our four holes in each side. And what's crazy is I only got three of these. So we're going to have to make do with what we got. What you're going to do is you're going to remember, like, you break the pieces of... Uh, pieces of the hanger stick them through the best way you can and there you got three prong and remember our our hobo uh, tea kettle you can set that on top but like sometimes like sometimes holes come out even so what you do is you could spread them apart and like I got three for if I do something else so that's good this the last bit of the hanger what you could do with that is you can uh, what you do is you curl one end down and then you take curl the other end but they line up But you turn it like this, so you have like a weird junky thing, and and like if you uh, if you can get it through the loops, through the little loops down here, then that would be good. But otherwise, it looks like a metal frame of a girl's head. You see the long hair and the head. But what you can use this as is when you if you make a tripod to set. To have an open flame on, you could take this and just hook it through here. Hook it through the um, hook it through your tea kettle like that, and it will still boil. But I re I really don't recommend that because of because it will make your handle hot in order to grab. But this you can use it for anything, so you could just add that to your survival kit. It can hold your fish if you went fishing and you don't you don't want to hang them on a tree that could have spiders or anything that could crawl down it. Um, and there's the two prong. And if you ever need it, just take it, stick it all the way through. The two that are on there, we're going to mount those to stay fit on it. Well, the pre, the pre, the three prong one works too. It's three prong, has no problems, and it stands up just fine. See, there it is, standing up, no problems. And also, uh, once I actually made one like this, this is like a duplicate of what I made. And what happened was, I didn't even bring my tea kettle. I only brought this and me and my friends stood outside and like I brought sausages and I just let the sausage sit on I made them into a patty and let them sit on there and cooked them up and turns out we had good sausages they were flame broiled too so now it, you can tell the difference between grill boil like being cooked on the stove and being cooked on flame because it has a lot more flavor to it but as you see there's our hobo stove we actually use both of them if you watch. If you watch my episodes, well, my, yeah, my episodes, we've used both of them. We've used this one and we've used this one. We've used this one the most, but this one on the prongs, we're gonna mount them to it. So you turn one one way. And then 
you do the same with the other one. Now you got your two prongs that are just fine. And if you turn them up like this, then it lets you know that there's pressure on it. I just do it like that. There you go. Oh, you probably can't see. Uh, okay. There you see it. I lift it up. They fall. Put it down. They're on. So that kind of lets you know it's on there securely. That That's how I use it. Sometimes that none of them will pop up, but if it stands on there and you could take your hand away from it and it won't fall, you got yourself a good tea kettle. And this third one, the third prong, just add that one in there. That one will be for extra just in case. Like you cook something big. And this one, oh my god, this one was the funnest to use. Just feeding sticks. And then like my brother was being special and threw on a beetle, so he cooked a beetle. I don't know why. I told him I said, okay, you cooked in there, you're gonna eat it. And he just looked at me. But if you can see in there. Uh hold on, I'm trying. Probably, if you can, that little glare, those are the ashes that are left over. So here's our little hook to apply the, to apply when using something or if you have a pot of, if you have a pot of, or whatever, a pot of water, soup, anything, this is what you can do. You can use this to hook it on. So, subscribe to my channel. And look forward for more how-to videos on bushcraft and stuff like this. And see you later next time. Have a good day.